Hi guys, how we doing? A couple of things that I want you to show in the video today is see my mostly my cherry tomatoes. See if you look at them, they're going kind of yellow. Has anybody got any idea what causes that? Is it lack of feed? Do they need fed? They're supposed to be four months feed in the compost, so is it the is it the wind? For the fan, could it be that? There's a couple of my Crimson Crush doing the same, but some, most of them look quite healthy. So I'm confused. If anybody knows what's wrong, please comment below. Let me know. And I can fix it. Um, the flowers that I showed, nothing's happening yet. That's only been, what, three days? So we'll see what's happening. Um, did you notice the gap that was in there? At the back? <laughs> See all those seed potatoes that I thought were, you know, dead, gone, dusted? Well, if you come through here and look out there, I don't know if you can see that because I can't. Just there. They're not dead. So what I need to do now is... Grab a bucket. Oh, I'm going to try and do this while we're holding the, the phone. Oh, I don't know if you can see that. Do you know what? I'm going to go and get a tripod. Back in a minute. Right, I'm back. Got the wee tripod out. Basically what I'm going to do is, I've seen folk doing this on YouTube before, so put the compost in the bin. Add some... potato fertiliser but I'm also going to add some organic all-purpose stuff and Some fish blood and bone. I'll turn that round so you can see it. Fish blood and bone. Handful of that. Right. Give that a mix. So what I need to try and do now is get these out of here, in there, and filled up with compost without breaking them. So, I'll put you down for a moment and I'll get back to you. I don't know if you can see me doing this. So, look at the roots on that, and I thought these were dead. I thought these seed potatoes were dead. So let's turn that up. Put that in there, and I'm only doing two per bucket this year. Um, I done four last year, and I think it was too much. I didn't get it. Uh, the potatoes I got were very small, um, so I'm only doing two this year to try it out, see if it's better. Um, I don't need to put your back down again. <laughs> Roots are lovely, really nice. And that's been what? Oh, about a week. No, maybe maybe 10 days. I can't remember to be honest. So now that I've got them in, 
and you can fill it up with compost. So, I'll very carefully just put the compost round about them and try not to break them. Just like this. Now I know we've got frosty weather and then up in Scotland we've got quite a bit of frost but it disappears, it doesn't last long but um, so I've got an old throw that the wife gave me uh, that I'll put over these but I don't know let's see if I can get this in Right, I'll carry on filling these up and I've got another four buckets to do. Plenty of compost, but oh, so while I'm here, remember the grass seed? I've cut my grass and you know the bare patches, rather than reseed that. I have done it in a box and then what I can do is cut out a square and put that in on the grass. So that's the grass seed starting to come up as well. So I'll get back to you when I'm, I've done all the buckets. See you soon. Okay. Here we have five buckets of Maris papers. And I've put some more fish blood and bone at the top so that when they get water the feed will go down. Well, that's the plan. Oh, I'm out of puff trying to move these bins, man. Um, and what I'll do later, I haven't watered them because I gave them a good soaking when I, uh, before I put them in. That throw there will be put over the top of them to save them for the frost. Um, and if I need be, when the actual shoots come through, if we're going to get a frost again, I'll move them into the, the garage and cover them there. Or rather, I'll get somebody to do it for me. <laughs> right, next, the only thing left to do now is... I haven't been in the tunnel for a couple of days, so we'll go and check and see what's happening. Oh. There we go. Okay, my onions still look okay. My leeks, they still look okay. Carrots are, these are last year's carrots, they're coming on. My turn up my cabbage have definitely died a death, so I'm gonna have to redo them. Peas looking good. Everything else seems to be looking okay. Oh, maybe no cabbage again. <laughs> so cabbage and turn up. Need to redo them, but I've decided that. Um, I'm just going to put them straight in the ground there. I'll do that after the frosty weather goes away. I know that they're cold hardy, but I'll still wait. And that's about us. Move. Here you go. Alfie, leave it. Alfie. He's chasing a bee. Hey, right, that's how it's done for today. I'll just uh, tidy up my mess. Um, but if anybody can tell me if it's up with my wee tomato plants, that would be quite cool. Do I just need to feed them? Maybe I just need to feed them. I don't know. Please comment below if you know the answer. And... If you could, 
if you don't mind hit the like button and subscribe to the channel uh, it really helps me out I'm over a hundred subscribers now so thanks very much for everybody who has subscribed and I'll, I'll sorry I'm out of puff with all that walking about and I'll catch you on the next one thanks for watching bye bye